cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. No, no, this place is actually kind of charming. It's got walls all the way around, and, well, that thing. Yeah, like I said, this is a pretty cool place. Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... they're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... they'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well, you know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Looks like someone's in the middle of a game. Well, he's not going anywhere. I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. Excuse me. Ah, oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20 year career. The way I see it. Nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. <laughs> and that got a lifetime ban? Nah, they just wanted to set an example. I was the poor bastard they used to do it on. All I know is what I read in the papers. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm. Don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. I don't really gamble anymore. Went all in on the wrong hand once. <laughs> it's okay, hon. I got this one. Raise. Moment of truth. Flip them. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight. Good looking hand there but not good looking enough. God damn it. And thanks for playing. Let me get you a drink for the assist. On the house. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal? And it's done. What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Because I don't scare easy, all right? And I don't respond to threats, neither. Just make it right. We can all walk away from this nice and easy. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. 
I could have died because of his bullets. I'm fucking believable. Look out! Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus, you gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. We had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the gun! Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Did he die? Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? She was just demonstrating that the bullets he sold her were faulty and the gun went off. What are you doing? All right, outside. You and me are gonna have a little talk. I'm telling you, he stop. was- Stop, just stop talking. And you, thanks for being straight with me. Go find Eleanor, she'll fix you up. Till her trip sent you. Now move it. All right, all right. Here you go. Try and get some rest, okay? Thanks, Eleanor. Ugh, that looks like a nasty cut. Oh, that must have hurt. Well, you've come to the right place. I've had a lot worse, believe me. Have a seat. I'll take a look. My name's Eleanor. Javier. You call me Javi. A little lower and you might have lost an eye. And that is not something you want to mess around with. I'm getting the feeling you've done this before. What makes you say that? You've got the whole thing down pat. You know, gauze, antibiotics, charming bedside manner. Yeah, I've done it once or twice. A day. So, I have to ask, is it true? What's that? I heard you were with that girl, Clementine. You put a bullet in some guy's brain over in the hangar. Don't act so surprised. News travels fast around here. Yeah, you heard right. That was me. Nothing like making new friends, huh? Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? <sighs> I've never understood it. See, that's where you got me wrong. I'm the furthest thing there is from trouble. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Look, I know you didn't pull the trigger, but that girl, Clementine, there's something cold behind her eyes. I don't know. Maybe she's just a scared kid. <sighs> I don't really know much at all. We just met a few hours ago. Hmm. Wait, I heard it. You two were pretty chummy before things got all out of hand. A thinger. She's helping me find my family. We were attacked earlier this evening. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. For family to make it this far? Not everybody gets that. I'm the one who's lucky. I'm not sure I'd have made it this long without the three of them. Hang in there. You're gonna find them. <laughs> Let go of me! There you go. Trip. What's going on? Clementine and I had a little talk. He's letting us leave once the herd passes. Oh, I'm gonna do more than that. I'm gonna hightail you two to that junkyard myself. Because frankly, 
I don't want her anywhere near this town. We'll leave sometime tomorrow, when it's safe. You two can spend the night here in the infirmary. I'll see you in the morning. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight, all three of us. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. If your family does need help, I'll be right there to give it. What? Seriously? Well, you do that for me. Well, you told me you weren't in any trouble. So, I'm gonna take your word on it. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. Huh. I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah. She's... She's something. The thing is, I still trust Trip more than I trust her. But hey, it's your call. Once we get to the junkyard, I get my van and we go our separate ways. We're leaving tonight. With Eleanor. If it gets us there even a minute sooner, it's worth it. You know, when you're out on your own, you can never really let your guard down. I was expecting you to defend me. Instead, you threw me under the bus. You basically sold me down the river earlier. I'm sorry, all right? Things were crazy. It just seemed like the right thing to do. Well, next time, just follow my lead. <laughs> just goes to show you, you can never really count on anyone else. Clementine, I... <sighs> I'm done talking. The doctor lady said she'd be a while. And I want to catch as much sleep as I can. Good night. Jay? That's dinner. Aren't you hungry? <sighs> We're out of food, AJ. We're gonna starve. I'm starving. We gotta... AJ, stay here while I find us dinner, okay? Uh, tell me you understand. <sighs> it's okay. I'll stay close. Don't worry, you'll see me right through the window. Just look for my hat. Oh, God. <laughs> 
<laughs> Sun's up. <sighs> Trip's probably mad as hell by now. What do you think he'll do to you? Oh, nothing. He'll yell at me a little. Trip and I, we sort of used to be a thing. It was for like five minutes, and it fizzled out fast. But he never really got over it. Not that he's weird about it or anything. I just know he likes having me around. Relationships can change pretty fast, and they're never not complicated. Sounds like you've got something on your mind. Or someone. Guys, that's the place. Yeah, this is it. Oh, shit. Guns out, yeah? If you insist. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? player Mariana Mariana are you here Javi Oh my god you're safe I can't believe it You told me where to hide I just listened to what you said Lock yourself in and don't come out not even once it's quiet It kept running through my head like on a loop I'm so sorry I left you behind I've been trying to get back here this whole time You don't have to be sorry you said you'd come back, and you did. Kate, and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go get your brother back, sweetie. Oh no. No, no sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. Wait! Nobody shoots. He's right. We fired the truck. We might hit them. See me? I'm happy to see all of you. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes, we might not have been. But then, you showed up. Just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. Oh. <laughs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like... Never gonna see you again, Dad. We only had a couple bullets left. You're still alive, aren't you? So is Kate. So is Mari. That's all that matters. I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Eleanor, think you can take a look? It's okay. I'm a doctor. I'll clean it here, then patch you up back home.
See? Better already. We should be getting back. Don't want to push our luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? Or are you going to make me do my own introductions? Clementine's a friend. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. You look happy. I am. Search and rescue missions don't usually end so well. Alive and healthy. Sort of incredible. Guess I'm a lucky guy. The luckiest. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. You know, considering... Considering what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. shooting again. I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'm gonna kill all of them. That's not gonna bring her back, Javi. So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you really want to help your family, you'll come with me. We can't wait anymore. We stay here and we finish this. Are you crazy? We have to go now. I already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Eleanor, help them. You stay with me. What? No, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, please come with us. Please. Javi, come on. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi. Go with them. I'll be fine. I need your help, Gabe. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. 